Hello, hello, hello. I wanted to do a quick video on the importance of cleaning your plates with 100% acetone. So I have here in this bottle just regular nail polish remover. Um, and I'm going to go ahead and clean up this plate. My daughter used it, my nine-year-old, and she kind of cleaned it, but not really. So I've got a little bit of the nail polish remover on here. Um, we'll go ahead and clean it up. You can see there it came off with a bunch of gunk. Um, then if you look, like it looks fairly clean now, but you can see some streaks and things in it. So now what I'm going to do is I'm going to use 100% acetone here. I have this bottle right here that I used just for cleaning my plates. So we'll do 100% acetone. I have that on the little pad here. And we'll go ahead and just clean this up. And look at that. Like it looked clean, but you can still see like that definitely wasn't completely clean. There were little oils inside the crevices of the images and things. Um, so there's that. There's this one right here that I cleaned with 100% acetone and I've only used once since cleaning it. Um, I used it to do this love stamp on my middle finger here because it was messed up when I put the top coat on. So um, I cleaned it uh, with 100% acetone, used the stamp, and then cleaned it with regular nail polish remover. Um, so we'll go ahead and clean this up just around that love stamp area. And you can see even more came off. So as you can see, the regular nail polish remover does not fully clean your plates. So if you're having trouble with your images on your plates, chances are it's because you're not using 100% acetone. Um, if you've used it and the, the image works great, and then you use it again and it works great, and you use it again and it works great, and then down the line it stops working as well, chances are you're not using 100% acetone to clean it. Now as you can see there's some streaking um, and just for, I mean, the, nothing with the streaking, it doesn't affect your image quality. Your image quality is fine. But if you're like me, you want your plates to be nice and shiny. So all that you have to do is just take 100% rubbing alcohol and just swipe over it. And the streaks are completely gone. It looks like a completely new plate. And there you have it. It's that simple. And if you look there, there's the pad that I just used with the rubbing alcohol on it and nothing has come up off of it. It's still just as clean as what it had been. So there's the importance of using 100% acetone to clean your plates. The, the nail polish gets into little crevices of the images and eventually uh, your images don't come out as clean and crisp as they could. So if you're finding that when you're using your plates, um, try using 100% acetone on your uh, plates and they'll clean up great. Um, with mine, with my bottle, it is a large bottle. Um, as you can see here, it's a 16 fluid ounce bottle. Just got it from CVS Pharmacy. Um, so it's super quick and easy to use. It's fairly inexpensive, but it cleans the plates up great. So there you have it. Until next time, don't forget to subscribe.